Hi, my name. Hi, my name is. You know, for yet another opportunity to be able to on my prototype, and I see how wonderfully it is making headway in my community. As of May 11, 2022, the total confirmed cases in my state is uh, 28,660, of which 16 cases were reported from my community as Sokoro. Yet, in my state overall and my community more particularly, the COVID-19 reporting process is often unreliable due to organizational and technical challenges. My solution is the first of its kind in my community and makes it easy for volunteers to report any suspected persons showing known COVID-19 symptoms such as cough, fever, difficulty in breathing. My solution is a geographical information system that allows instance reporting and mapping of COVID cases for decision makers, and though the potential is limitless. Based on the feedback from my prototype testing, here are the areas of improvement so far. I'm improving on the reliability of the reports, a verification process that links with the NS volunteer management system to ensure that reports are done or made by registered volunteers. Again, I'm adding an extra collection of data to contextualize if victims have been vaccinated or not, how many doses they have, they have taken and what vaccine products. Also, an adaption of the user interface to our local language, which is Aosai, Igbo, and Yoruba, as some people in my community do not read English. Again, a thank you. I'm improving on the thank you, on adding a thank you and a rewarding system for the volunteers' input to appreciate them for their fidelity. Also, uh, allowing inputs through different means, not requiring owning a smartphone and having any internet connection. During my mentorship, my mentor opened my eye to a community-based surveillance system, CBS, which is similar to my project. And I'm studying and researching on it, on how it can be useful and how it can help improve my project. My community is called Asokoro. Has an estimated population of 16,733, of which 4,100 are members of the Nigerian Red Cross, with only 1,897 whom are active volunteers. To measure my success, there has been increasing participation by volunteers who like the fact that the app only reports cases and not people or victims for security reasons. Plus, the fact that volunteers see it as a tool to prove their worth as a member of the Red Cross Society. I will need a 50 to 100 capacity hall or training center with modern facilities like AC, Wi-Fi, restrooms, etc. in a serene environment where I can train at least 1,000 to 1,500 volunteers in badges on how to use the Red Box and on the basics of GIS. This is an opportunity of giving new skills to volunteers as well. I am currently talking with King City Global Solutions Nigeria Limited about their potential involvement in the project in helping in training. Also, I will be partnering with a service provider to help with an automatic thank you text message and email. My next step would be to firstly add a translate command on the app interface so one can easily switch from English to either of the three major languages, which is Aosa, Igbo, and Yoruba. Secondly, to initiate an automated thank you text or email to appreciate volunteers for their fidelity. Also, train volunteers on how to use the app and on the basics of GIS. And lastly, to establish the partnership with King City Global Solutions Nigeria Limited and with the telecom providers through the National Society, the NS. My National Society is working closely with me and providing any possible support to see that my project gets through and it is adaptable, especially with the new idea to include vaccination data. They pointed out that vaccine rollout data is usually reported by the number of doses of coronavirus vaccines administered and not the number of people who have been vaccinated. So they see the Redbox application as a solution for community-based volunteers to have access to what is needed to address vaccine hesitancy and plan the future, more ways to sensitize communities about the adherence to preventive measures. <laughs>